Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain quiet for the minute of silence. Good morning, Chantilly. I'm Emily Shridhar. And I'm Cooper Young. Today is January 6th, 2023. And here are your morning announcements. Today is an A day with LS7 and CT. Monday is a B day. Yearbooks are on sale. Go to yearbookordercenter.com and enter code 4166. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Nguyen in room 229. The softball team will be having off-season workouts every Friday at 3.30 on the softball field. If you have any questions, please contact the softball Instagram at Chantilly Softball. If you took driver's ed over the summer and have not picked up your pink card, which is your certificate of completion, please come by the activities office to pick it up. Here's James with the weekly sports roundup. Good morning, Chantilly. Welcome to the Weekly Sports Roundup. Here's an update on how our sports teams are doing. Varsity Girls Basketball competed in the Light Ridge High School Holiday Tournament. They went 2-1, finishing the tournament in third place. Emerson Mustard was named to the All-Tournament Team. The gymnastics team had a meet at home on Tuesday. They finished in fourth at the meet. Over winter break, the wrestling team finished in 10th place out of 50 teams at the Battle of the Bridge in Woodbridge. That's all we have for this week's Roundup. Now back to the anchors. Paying for college can be a stressful thing. Reporter Creedy has a story on one student who was granted a full scholarship to UVA. Senior Imran Rahimzi recently received the news that he will be attending UVA as a Posey scholar. But to get the scholarship, he had to go through a major process. Near the end of my junior year, I was just going through Ms. Grinder's emails, and at the bottom, she has scholarships, and uh, Posse is one of them that you can nominate yourself, and you get nominated through Chantilly, so juniors this year, be on the lookout near the end of the year, that's when the process gets started. So once I got nominated, uh, it, there, it was a three-round interview, so uh, first one is in August, it's a preliminary round, it's like a, you submit supplements before, and like all your information or your transcript, and then you uh, go for like a three and a half, four hour interview, and then you wait a month, and then you get notified if you got to the semifinalist round, which is another couple supplements that you have to then submit, and then there's another interview, and that one is uh, different. The first interview is like a group interview, so all the other nominated people in your like, from like that day, so they have multiple days of interviews, uh, you interview together, but then the, on the semifinalist round, it's a 2v1, so like uh, one of their alumni, and then their foundation worker, and then uh, they just grill you for like 40 minutes, 45 minutes. And then lastly, you wait another month, and then they let you know if you're a finalist. And uh, then uh, it's a final interview. It's like three and a half, four hours, and you meet with the deans of the college that you're applying to, and their, uh, their counselors, their admissions people, and then the scholarships foundation people, and they have one last group interview where they kind of just uh, go through like your, the same type of grilling, but again in a group set setting. After the grueling process, Irman was given the news. Yeah, so uh, they call you that night of after the interview, 
And so I was just playing FIFA with my brother and uh, I got the call from a random number in California and they told me to hop on the call again and that's when I got told that I had gotten it and I was kind of shocked really and I didn't I didn't really have a response I was kind of just like taken aback but it was a it was a pretty cool experience overall yeah I'm very excited to just go into the next chapter of my life and kind of growing to keep up with scholarships, students can look at Ms. Griner's weekly emails to keep up with opportunities. This has been Kriti Sharma and Eli Ehlers for the Nightly News. Now back to you. Congratulations, Imran. And wishing you the best of luck at UVA. Well, that's all we have for you today, Chantilly. This has been Emily Sridhar. And Cooper Young, reminding you to stay positive, stay safe, and have a great day. And we'll see you on Monday.